What is up YouTube? I'm back once again with another DIY Tesla power update video. Now, as you can see, I have um, some cell testers there now. I have my extra battery charger, and I've also got a couple more cells from the last video. So basically, I finished soldering these packs over there. So those are in service now, those are in parallel with this. I've got them flipped the other way, other way around so I can have them connecting there and then having a wire going across. Um, the setup I have right now is not ideal. Um, the wires are a bit too thin, um, but for testing purposes, it's going to work. There's a lot of trial and error with this setup. So basically what I have now is these batteries running on the whole system. Battery down here is disconnected. Um, I've got like, uh, wires all insulated and all that stuff. A few solder burn marks around my soldering iron and that was the top of the desk. But other than that, we have obviously more cells now. I've got some of the nice pink and the green Samsung cells, the three amp hour and the two and a half amp hour cells. And we've also got the standard Samsung two amp hour turquoise cells. So basically my plans for this video are to kind of show you guys where I'm heading, uh, the future proofing I'm doing to this system. So if later in the future I want to do 48 volts, which is the main thing future proofing for, to be able to do that. Basically my plan is to make two more of these sets. So obviously 14S. Um, and those were made with one of the packs that were here that was ready to be made, but then I changed my mind. I, I preferred smaller packs. So the cells I'm gonna use for 14 of these are over here. So these are the packs I'm going to use for the 14S. Obviously I'm gonna need a few additional cells. So here are the packs I'm going to use. My camera's really shuttery, so if you do notice that, um, please don't mind that, I don't know what's wrong with it. Um, but anyway, uh, so these are the cells I'm primarily going to use. I've got the cell holders here, all ready to go. Um, so pretty much I'm going to transfer these over um, and then add the cells that I have here. So yeah, there isn't too much more to this update. It's just a bit of an indication of what I'm doing. I've still got more cells down there, obviously, to um, process. But pretty much I am prepping for 48 volts, so it'll be a nice thing. I want to get my new um, MPPT slash um, inverter in kind of thing but that's um, obviously a thousand dollars i'm still saving up for that yeah other than that i'm going to continue testing cells i'm going to rip this pack apart which is going to be in the next video so if you guys want to see me rip open a perfectly good pack stay tuned for that that's going to be for the next episode that's pretty much it for this one please give this video a like and subscribe for more videos like this and thank you very much for watching